Yes. Yes. Great. Now the scripture of tonight is coming from Joshua, second chapter. It starts off verse eight. It says, this book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day and night, that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous, and then thou shalt have good success. Have not I commanded thee, be strong and of a good courage. Be not afraid, neither be thou dismayed, for the Lord thy God is with thee whatsoever thy goest. May the Lord have a blessing to the reading of his word. That's Joshua second chapter, verses eight through verse nine. Glory to God. Again, we thank God. Thank God for the presence of everyone on Zoom, every conference line. Thank God for one more time. Glory to God. We're gonna we are looking forward, we're going to get getting our lesson. This has been, and I'm sure this has been a this is this day has been a uh, a, 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 as we know already, this this pandemic and all things are going on. It's been a it's, it's all not normal, different, but we see that even today, uh, it's a, it's a, it's a very it's possible that we might have our first vice president, uh, female mm. vice president. Mm. So it's a lot of new things that's happening, a lot of shifts, a lot of things that's going on that never happened before, and you see it that it's possible that once the election. This is possible that this might happen as well. So, so it's a, it's a lot of different shifts and different things are changing throughout this pandemic. Glory to God. Amen. Glory to God. But we thank God for the word of God because the word of God is, is consistent. Yes. <laughs> thank yes. God when every other thing is going up and down, sideways, all kinds of different ways. But the word of God is saying it was, was, was stay the same. Glory to God. We thank God for the word of God. And again, we thank God for uh, each and every one. Uh, we're going. We're going to get go right to each one. Teach one. I'm um, gonna check and see if if um, I know uh, Pastor Paul might uh, see if he's able to. I know he has. A, uh, it's possible that he might have one scripture, and if, uh, see if because we know that he has to get off the line a little earlier than the rest of us. So, so we will give him uh, first opportunity there. Glory to God. And praise the Lord, Pastor Paul. I bless you. Oh, yeah. uh, <laughs> we, we we don't have to get off early tonight. All right, all right. We we we, we can stay the whole service to God be the glory. All right. Amen. 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 Oh, we, we, just, we, 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 we. just before I have <laughs> I, I do have a song that I wanted and 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 not to interrupt, praise the Lord, everybody. Past passages uh 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 I was reminding him we did have a, another song. However, just before that gives you a space to 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 get ready. But this song, I, I only wanted to play, even if it's just a portion of it, because we wanted to encourage everybody. We wanted to make sure everybody was encouraged. Okay, so just bear with me. And Pastor Paul, I already know, you know, you 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 got the shouting shoes on and, and all and all of that. You know, I, I already know that. So, so just, just, but just one second. Is, okay. You okay. Now take your time. Let's have some church. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know about nobody else. I don't want to have church. I want to have some church. <laughs> Let's have some church. That she was in a little pain tonight. She said if she can come on, she will. So just continue to keep her up in prayer. So give me give me one second, and I'm gonna share the screen. And if it's acting up, please let me know because I'll take it off the share, and then it may act better. Okay. To know that God has provided for us. And Praise God, because it can keep on going. But I'll, I'll stop it right there. I was one of the ones who did. Millions didn't make it. Praise God. Praise God. <laughs> Hallelujah. 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 Praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Thank God again for that. Oh, beautiful. I'm glad we did get that song. Glory to God. Glory to God. It's a blessing. Blessing. Hallelujah. To be one of the ones who did. Glory to God. Glory to God. Everything you're doing is not in vain. We thank God. Well, at this time, we're going to turn the hands up. <laughs> <laughs> That's the fault. <laughs> uh, y'all did this. Y'all did this. Uh, 
now now you got me thinking. You got you 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 got me thinking because million didn't make it. Glory. Hallelujah. Million. Now, that that goes with the lesson, but I'm not going to get on that just yet because mm-hmm. Pastor read something that I got to tackle. Uh, millions didn't make it. There, there are so many that have the form of God. Yes, right. yes, 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 yes. There, there are so many that say they are Christian. There are so many that say that they are saved. Mm-hmm. But are you saved like the Bible said? Uh, have you received since you believe? Yes. Oh, yes, you believe. That, 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 that's the question that he's going to ask a million. But I'm one of the ones who did. Yes. I, 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 I made it over. Uh, I, I done passed on from death unto life. I'm, my name is written in the Lamb book of life. I'm, he said, these are they that have been washed in the blood of the... I'm one of Hallelujah. the ones that have been washed. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Glory. I'm, one, I'm one of the ones who've been redeemed. Blood bought. <laughs> oh, let me leave that alone, Pastor. You you read Joshua one, eight and nine. Can you read that for me one more time, sir? Yes, Joshua eight. It's Joshua one and eight. It says, "This book of the law shall not depart from thy mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day and night." That this, this is what he's talking about. He's telling us, if you one of the ones that have been purchased, this, this this book should not come out of your mouth. This this should be something that you meditate day and night. This just like you feed your natural body, you should feed your spiritual. This is your oh, come on, Pastor, talk to me. That's a life, man. Glory yeah, to God. Yeah. Glory to God. But may as I obtain, observe to do according to all that is written therein, for then thou shalt make thy way prosperous, and then thou shalt have good success. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Have not I commanded thee, be strong. What? Oh, God. Come on. Be strong and of a good courage. Uh-huh. Be not afraid, neither be thou dismayed. For the Lord thy God is with thee, whether ever so ever thy goes. Glory to God. Uh, I'm gonna leave that alone. <laughs> I get in. I gotta get into the lesson now. She <laughs> played. We exalt thee. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Mm. This is the reason that I praise him because I'm one of the ones who. Oh God, help me. Uh, Mm. I ain't supposed to do this to me tonight. I, I know I said I'm gonna be with y'all all night, but y'all ain't supposed to do this to me. <laughs> Praise, God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Mm. Mm. One of the one. Mm. Mm. Don't, don't start that, evangelist. Don't start that. <laughs> don't, don't, don't start. Don't start that. Number with the sanctify. Mm. Uh, now, now, see, she. I told her don't start. Y'all blame her this one. <laughs> they, they, she used to sing a song, they got the word. Uh, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah, hallelujah. They got the word. Listen, now I'm a part of they. Oh, good God from heaven. I got the word. I, I'm going to be there when the saints of God gather together. I'm going to be a part of the rapture. I'm going to be a part. Oh, oh, my name. Oh. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I made it over. I, I made it. I made it. I, I'm, I'm, I'm excited that I'm a part of the redeemed. 
right, yes. all right, all right. I'm a part yes, of yes, yes, yes. The redeemed. I'm I'm so glad. Let me stop. Let me let me do what's proper in order. Amen. We was taught better than this. Amen. We can get excited later, but let's do what's decent and in order. We honor the Lord tonight to uh, the Spirit of God and to the pastor, Pastor Perkins and Lady Perkins, the deacon and evangelist, and all the saints of the Most High God. We thank God for another opportunity that he has allowed us to teach one, each one, teach one. <laughs> Amen. To be a part of this fine institution of learning. Uh, the Bible says, Amen. Search the scripture. Yes. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Search the scripture. For in them you think you have eternal life, but they testify of me. The question is, are you of me? Mm. Uh, can can you be one that testified that you are of the redeemed? And can can your life testify, not your lips? Uh, can your life testify that you are uh, of the redeemed? The, the scripture says they praise me and worship me with their mouth, but their heart is far. From I, I'm glad that he created me a clean heart and got all the hell out of there. Y'all know y'all remember how I used to be. I, and ain't nobody can tell me that God can't save if he can save somebody like me Hallelujah. and created me a clean heart. Yes. Yes. Then you can't tell me that he can't save. All right, all right. Not only can he save, but he can keep. Yes. You want to be kept. Uh, I'm glad that I'm one of them that needs to be kept. Uh, yeah. uh, I, I didn't pass from being want to be kept. I need to be kept. Amen. Amen. Got to be kept. I, I, it ain't no other way around. I, I, I ain't got no other desire. I need him to keep me. Hallelujah. Yes, yes, yes. All right. Yes, yes. yes. Because without him, I can do nothing. Yes. Without him, I definitely gonna fall. Mm. Without him, I'm just like a ship. Without a sail, I, I'm I'm gonna be tossed in to and fro. But with him, I'm steady. Mm -hmm. With him, I got a foundation. With him, I can stand. Mm -hmm. With him, I can rejoice. Uh, with him, with him, with him. We have, we have been given this awesome, awesome scripture. Uh, and I'm not going to preach. I'm just going to teach. And we, we can do Daniel next week. And <laughs> I, I, I'm just going to let y'all, because <laughs> I've been looking at Daniel too. <laughs> but we ain't going to do Daniel too. <laughs> Oh, that, that got too many jewels in there. That got too many. Whew. Good Lord, have mercy. Whoever found that scripture, y'all don't know what y'all doing. Uh, Acts chapter 19, verse 2. <laughs> Acts verse, Acts chapter 19, and verse 2. That's some meat. That is some meat in there. Mm -hmm. Because he's, he's talking some serious business. Yes. And in my research, I find, uh, it, even though he was talking to the unsaved, uh, if we look at this thing today, he's talking to the saved. All right, all right, all right. All right. All right. All right. Because mm -hmm. some of us ain't shouted since shouting came about. <laughs> All right. Some of us ain't moved. Some of us ain't moved in God knows how long. <laughs> hey, man, you, you need to get back to being quickened. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. 
uh, I, I'm gonna behave. Let's let's just let's just talk. Acts chapter nineteen verse two, and it says, "He said unto them, Have ye received the Holy Ghost?' Stop. Now, why do we put Holy Spirit on everything instead of what the Bible says, which He called it the Holy Ghost? Yeah. He, he don't call it Holy Spirit. He said, have you received Amen. the Amen. Holy Ghost? Ghost. Yes, say that. That's saying something. Have you received? Now, some of us got a ghost, but it ain't holy. <laughs> That's right. He ain't talking about that ghost because that ghost, that ghost eat anything. That ghost believes anything. That ghost will follow anything. But the Holy Ghost is following God himself. Yeah. Because these three agree in one. And the Bible in St. John 10 and 30 said, me and my father are one. Uh -huh. So there's no trinity let, let, let's knock that out the house right now. Ain't no trinity in this thing. Mm -hmm. Amen. There ain't no three. They are one. Yes. One Lord, one faith, and there's only one baptism. And that uh -huh. baptism is in the baptism of Jesus. Uh, let me stop. He said, have you received the Holy Ghost since ye believe? Mm -hmm. I started to talk to God today about this. And I imagine me and God conversation. And God told me, he said, now, how long have you believed it? How long have you believed it? Okay. How, how long have you believed? Not how long have you heard about me, but how long have you believed it? Uh, that thing got personal then, y'all. I, I, well, you know, we all heard about the Holy Ghost down through the years when we wasn't saved. But when did this thing become personal to you? Uh huh. Uh huh. That you believe that what he said right, to right, you yeah. was sufficient. What he said to you yeah. was right. What he said to you, I, I, I was listening, amen, to Lady Perkins, and she said, I, I, I had to, he had to talk to me for me. Uh, I, I thought I was all right. I, I knew I was in sin, but I thought I was all right. But he had to show me me. All right. Yes, 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 yes. It comes a time that you have to see him for yourself. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So he asked me, how long have you believed in me? And I turned around and I said, Lord, you you kept me from, uh, from the age of 17 to now. Wow. He said, but when have you started to lose sight of what you believed? Hmm. Y'all don't, y'all, I don't know if he talked to y'all like that. <sighs> and I turned around, I said, uh, Lord, I, I didn't lose too much sight. I he said, yes, you did. Right. He said, when you started to lay down with somebody that wasn't your wife. Oh. That's Lord, that's right. yeah, that's a, that was a hard pill to swallow. But that was the avenue that I was in. He started to show me that the enemy was trying to sift me as wheat. He said, but because I knew what I placed in you, it wasn't about what you felt. He said, I placed something in you that made that which was in you to overcome what you felt. Mm. Hallelujah. I said, God, you so, you, you, you so, he said, now nah, I'm going to talk to you. If you're going to talk tonight, I got to talk to you about you. 
I got it. All right, all right. Because he said you got to be the first partaker. That's it. Yeah, somebody of us, some of us want to talk this thing, but we don't never want to examine us. Mm. Uh, let me finish this scripture. And he said, yeah, and they yeah. said unto him, they answered him and said, we have not so much as heard whether there be any Holy Ghost. Mm. I got my God. We, there's some apostolic people that ain't heard oh my God, my mm. God, that there is an apostolic. There, there's, mm. They haven't heard. They, they go into a building, but they haven't heard. Mm -hmm. right. Right. Mm -hmm. The Bible says, uh, he that has an ear, mm -hmm. right. it, 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 let him hear what the Spirit says unto the church. The church is not the building. The church is in you. Okay. So yeah. how much, how much do the Spirit have to say that you are willing to hear? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Somebody said he he don't talk all day. You ain't you ain't listening. That's what it is. He, he he'll talk to you if you want to listen. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, he'll Amen. Talk to you if Amen. you want to listen. Yeah. The That's question right. is, do you want to listen? Uh -huh. Oh Lord, Amen. help me tonight. Say that. So he said, now let's get to the meat. Let's eat this thing. Amen. Let's dissect this scripture. He said, have you, have ye received the Holy Ghost since ye believe? Have you received? There is more than just speaking in tongues with the Holy Ghost. Say that. Say that. Amen. The Holy Ghost got more responsibility than just letting you say hikamasha. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. I, 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 I remember Bishop Tyler, somebody was saying, Oh, but I see. And Bishop Tyler said, Stop saying that unless you're going to tell me what you see. What is he revealing to you? I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't saying nobody name, but did that tell you right there, amen, that the Holy Ghost got more responsibility yeah. than just speaking in a tongue. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And the Holy Ghost tongue, the Bible says that the Holy Ghost speaks in tongue so that them that don't have the Holy Ghost might believe. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Yes. yes, but he said, "Now, if you speaking in tongue, it is to for you. Now, if you speaking it outwardly, he said, now that means that if you gonna prophesy and you gotta you saying that you gotta work, and nobody interprets what is being said, that the Holy Ghost that wasn't the Holy Ghost, that was you." Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Go ahead. Teach we that. got some, we got some people. All right. We got some people that likes to be seen. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And they got a I got a word from the Lord. Well, uh, Pastor, forgive me. Forgive me, Pastor. How you gonna have a word from the Lord and you ain't received <laughs> since you believe? Mm. <laughs> what have the Holy Ghost changed in you? Ah, yeah. Mm. That's it. That's it. And it starts from the inside and shows outward. Mm -hmm. Now I I, I I can testify about me because I was one that would hit you and didn't care about hitting you. That 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 was my pleasure. I love to do that. If I was if I was if, if I was bold enough to stand up to Shaquille O'Neal, Amen. Her hands is bigger than mine. 
then nobody can scare me that much. Uh, I, but see, I learned that it wasn't so much that I wasn't afraid of her. It was that I didn't recognize, even though she was saved, I didn't recognize the fear, the Holy Ghost that was in her. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I fear. I feared the Holy Ghost that was in Bishop Tyler. I feared the Holy Ghost that was in Mr. Tyler. Mama made me fear the Holy Ghost that was in her. <laughs> <laughs> there was no incense of us about it. Mama Edwards made me fear the Holy Ghost that was in her. You gonna fear me and the Holy Ghost that's walking in me. <laughs> True, <laughs> you make you. We gonna we we gonna help you. We gonna help you meet the Creator before your time. <laughs> <laughs> so I turned around. I said, "Now, the Holy Ghost." Is not there to make somebody fear them. Mm -hmm. Right. The Holy Ghost is there to show them that God can change them. Yes. But He got to change you. Mm -hmm. So, have you received the Holy Ghost since you believe? What steps have you changed or have the Holy Ghost been able to change in you so that somebody can see that he is God? Hallelujah. Yes, yes. Don't necessarily mean that you're going to church. Everybody going to a building. Amen. That don't mean they in the church. Mm -hmm. Amen. Uh-huh. I, I kid y'all not. I, I think it was. <laughs> I think uh, it was either uh, Evangelist Clark or Lady Perkins said that Evangelist Owens been like this since she got the Holy Ghost. Mm -hmm. yeah. The way that she goes, she been like that since she got the Holy Ghost. Uh -huh. Amen. And, and I used to try to sneak under her. <laughs> when the Holy Ghost hit her while she was ushering, I was trying to sneak and, and, and get under her because if I felt the anointing bust on her, I I ain't never felt it like that on the other saints. I ain't saying they didn't have it, but she was a newborn baby. I I felt that thing hit her. And then when it hit her and she started swinging, I, I, I was ducking and moving. But I was trying to stay with her. <laughs> <laughs> and Mama Edwards would come and pull my ear and tell me, get out the way before you get knocked out. She sw that The Holy Ghost got her, but boy, you, that's some powerful <laughs> swings right there. You better move. It was that I'm learning that the anointing was drawing me. All right, that's it. That's, uh huh. That's it. See, that's where that's where that, that. See, that's when he said, "Have you received the Holy Ghost since you believe?" See, when you believe that the Word of God is what He said it is, and when the Holy Ghost has free range to do what it needs to do, it comes with anointing. It comes with power. It comes with. Uh, yes, it, it got a job to do. Got a job to do. All right. All right. Mm. I got mm. but they asked now this is this was very 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 uh very interesting when I was researching because it said the question that Paul asked uh, translated in another way he said did you receive the Holy Ghost when you believe mm hmm and I started to ask God, what what was Paul's translation? What why did they say that Paul was thinking like this? He said, because a lot of people are still walking around with Romans 10 and 9. Mm. All right, all right, mm -hmm. all right. If you confess with your mouth and believe in your heart that God has raised Jesus from the dead, thou shalt be saved. There's some more behind. <laughs> Uh, 
and you can confess, but Lord have mercy, there's some more that I gotta do after confessing. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Can I? Ooh. Hmm. There's okay. some more that I have to do after speaking that I I'm saved now. Now. Now, I, I'm going to say this, and I, I, I'm going to say it till the day I die. I ain't never seen, and I ain't trying to pat nobody on the back, but I'm just speaking truth. Lady Perkin, Zena, Lady Evangelist Owen, Deacon Stovall, received the Holy Ghost. We was in Bible class on a Sunday, and Mama Edward put everybody on the altar. Mm, I got it, I got it. Aunt Melody stood up and said, they already got the Holy Ghost. Mama Edward said, everybody still get on the altar. Mm, I got it. Normally, it was just the unsaved that got on the altar. The, the saved would tarry with the unsaved. They, <laughs> but Lady Perkins, the Cristobal, Vandalus Owens, they still got on the altar. By the time the saints came out of the kitchen and came oh. in the church, <laughs> Bishop Tyler said, "Are oh, y'all having y'all in here having service?" Mm, I got, I got, I got. They uh -huh. was in there having. I, I listen. I got up. There was no need for me to get on their altar and just start trying to <laughs> fake like I'm gonna repent and do all this kind of. <laughs> I, I, when the Holy Ghost started hitting them three, I went ahead and got up and went to my seat. And just sat there because it, I ain't gonna need to be lying to God. I ain't gonna play with God in this house. <laughs> that was that's true. I was watching too. I ain't. I'm gonna sit here. Maybe it hit me when it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just being honest, Pastor. Zena <laughs> was going off in her chair. Uncle Michael was in the choir stand, and Lady Perkins was in the middle aisle spinning in circles. <laughs> and Aunt Ellie was running around, uh, running around in the back of the church, just running. And I'm turning around. I said, "Now, what was the use of all us getting on the altar <laughs> if these three was going to take over the service?" <laughs> what was the you. purpose? They had them testers, some indirect testers. Oh God. I was there that night. They went, and that service went, went bananas. It went, it bananas. went crazy. It went and bananas. I'm sitting up there, I'm a young kid. What's the use of me sitting up here trying to fake, pretending <laughs> like I'm going to repent? They <laughs> took over the service. <laughs> All you need to ask them to get on the altar. Let's see if you really got it like y'all say. Y'all, The Holy Ghost was going to show up in two or three minutes. Just let them do what they got to do. <laughs> they had them. They had them indirect testers. Oh yeah, I was there for that. That 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 service was. They just came. The saints just came in, and it it just it just bounced off. It just bounced, bounced, bounced. It, bounced. it, it was all over the place. Everybody. Mm -hmm. And I'm turning around. And I'm sitting up there. I told uh, Melody when we was on our way home, "Don't ever let me stay in a service like this." <laughs> <laughs> She said, you need to be getting saved yourself. I said, well, listen, they already took all the salvation that God <laughs> has for everybody in Revelation. He on a vacation. He ain't giving nobody else no Holy Ghost now. He didn't pour <laughs> out so much on them. I don't think he got enough for us. <laughs> oh, thank you, Lord, for it. Thank you for Revelation. Praise God. My God, my God. <sighs> You, but he, he, go ahead. Who? who praise the Lord. I wanted. I wanted to say something when you was talking about, because uh, it dropped to me. I, and, I mean, it, it's something just. It got. It. it um, let me say. A light came on a little bit when you were saying about um, have. Uh, have you received since you believe? 
it took me back to this, uh, and I can't say what scriptures, but it, you, when I say it, you'll know what I'm talking about. We were in a Sunday school lesson, and uh, when they were talking about um, the of and in, <laughs> and when the when when the man was believing of the God of Abraham, mm -hmm. then we as he went further down in the scriptures, then he said the God in Israel. Mm -hmm. See, there's a belief. I believe in God. I believe in the God you're talking about. But when it gets to the point that I believe that the word of God that is being spoke is God and I'm listening to it penetrate, now he's becoming the God in me because I'm believing in the very word that is pricking my heart. If it don't prick, if it don't penetrate, I'm still just saying, yeah, I believe, I, I believe God can do it. I believe I, whatever you say, I, you tell me to pray. I believe, I believe there is a God. See, it has to go past, I believe there is a God. Uh. But when you start uh, believing past there is a God and then you start hearing the word and you say, that is God. Right. And it start the word, the very word that you believe in coming that the, I mean, he could be saying the same scripture you've been hearing five years ago. <laughs> you heard the word, you heard that scripture five, <laughs> ten years past, but all of a sudden that same word come and prick. All right, all right. That word became life, and you start seeing God in that very word that was spoken. So now, have ye received sense? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You, believe, you can sit all day long and just sit. I mean, how many years? And I can say, how many years did I say, yeah, I, I talk, I'm right there along with Paul, trust me. We sitting in church <laughs> looking at all these people shouting around and everything else. I is I now I wasn't like Paul. I didn't sit up and say, let me get up in this altar, da 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 da. I my old silly self get up and try to blend. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I try to blend and I'm sitting up there. I didn't get, I'm blending out of emotion. See, I'm blending out of emotion because I'm believing, I'm believing there is a God. I believe in the God of Pastor Tyler, Bishop Tyler. I'm believing because I'm watching him do the things they said he would do. Mm -hmm. They're receiving the Holy Ghost. I mean, I saw people, I saw Brother Flowers receive the Holy Ghost. I saw all this. I saw Melody receive the Holy Ghost. I know that it is possible. So I, I blended. I'm in service and the most, you know, service get high. The anointing is falling. Next you know, here I am blending because I'm emotional and I want to stand up and make all these big declarations be like, I'm going to stay right here and tell the Lord, save me, you know, and the saints be all encouraging, like, oh, bless the da, 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 da. But all them years that I was sitting up here saying that, I didn't mean it because it didn't break. It didn't change. Nothing. I was emotional, driven by emotion. But that point when I said, Lord, take it. That's it. The word that was already taught to me brought me to the Lord, take it. So it's words that I've heard previous. So now the word became life. Now when I believe, now February, that's when I received the Holy Ghost. Because now the very word it was God and it penetrated in me. So that right there is God of, God in. And did I believe since I believe? Glory to God. Amen, amen, amen. Glory to God. My God, my God. That's just my experience. That's why I said I'm not trying to take nothing away from nobody else. That's it. That's it. Evangelist Owen. Praise the Lord, everybody. Excuse my icon for tonight. Can you hear me? Yes, yes, can we can hear you. Hear you. Amen. Um, I'm thinking of the word, have you received? In the scripture, we've been asked many questions. Have you not heard? You mm -hmm. know? Have you heard? But have you received? 
it, it, it is have you made it yours all right. have you made him yours have you taken him on take my yoke upon you and learn me have you opened up your heart and began to walk in what you believe have you applied it when you receive it mm. have you received this past have you heard have you not heard <laughs> remember that but receive me i've i've taken it on when you receive the package in the mail your name is on it it is yours it belongs to you i have received my mail i received my email when you receive something somebody who gave it to you is waiting on what well, is usually waiting on a reply that's it. that's it i be asking people did you get my text well i don't know if you got it if you don't reply Sometimes you get lost in transmission. But when you have received, Paul said, I have received the Lord, that which I give unto you. That what I received it. It's mine. I have it in my possession. And I'm using it. I received it. The song said, um, prepare him room. Let every heart prepare him room. We can't leave some stuff if we got too much stuff. Sometimes you want something, but you ain't got no room to receive it because you got too much in there already. Okay, Pastor. We got to sometimes prepare our hearts that's, that's... to be open, to receive. And you can't receive it without hearing first anyway because it goes through the ear gate before it even gets receptive in the heart. Make me... Mm -hmm. That's all. Praise God. Praise yeah. God. That that's Pastor Paul. That's the song. Uh, make room. Uh, <laughs> why you do that? Why you do that to me? <laughs> make room. Make room. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, just one one comment, and, and then you know, give turn it back over. I'm just I'm just listening to everything. I'm I'm I'm. Uh, um, he said that this is this is some meat and and it it is because it it it's speaking to we hear where i i'm i'm going back and forth cuz i'm making notes from different things but i'm looking at the part where she, you mentioned the herd uh um if you Pastor Paul said earlier the ear gate let it let if you don't even hear you cannot believe you you cannot receive it if you don't even hear it and so here it said we have not so much as heard it so it her could be twofold did some have having anyone introduced it to you having anybody have no hit what what are the the preachers supposed to be doing are they giving you the gospel? Are they telling you the truth? You know, so therefore, are you giving me what I need to hear? You, you understand what I'm saying? Then, then now that's on the one that's giving it, that, that's uh, 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 been anointed to preach the gospel. Then you have the receiver, the receiver. What is your ear gate like? Is it stopped up? What have you placed in your ear gate that causes you not to hear it? Because if you don't hear it with the spiritual ear, you will not believe it. And, and another thing that I find a lot of times is if, in, if you've been given it a certain way, and, and that goes to the part where earlier uh um about when pastor paul mentioned uh about examine mm -hmm. about examine yourself because sometimes people are giving it to you as the milk not the meat so you're talking meat right now I mean, somebody is giving it to you as the 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 milk and they they we we get a lot that well you know as long as you feel the goosebumps and whatever that's the holy spirit coming up on you you got it already you got it. so therefore 
You won't press into that next level of believing. You stop at that first level of believing because someone told you that that was okay, that that's all you need. That's all you have to do is just you believe God and now it's already a done data. But there is another level and that's what this scripture is trying to bring them to into another level because they at this point they was already saying all we know is the baptism unto repentance we haven't heard the rest of it we didn't even know there was a rest of it and so that's what uh, a god is calling us to do is to give the people the rest of it let the people know the rest of it we are we we are past the point of just being baptized until repentance. He said, I'm trying to come and live in you, but you got to, with evangelists on, say, make room for me to live in you. But we never heard that he can live in us. We never heard that that was necessary. We never heard. But did, you, did you not hear it or did they not tell you? You understand what I'm saying? So there's a twofold here. We got to get that spiritual ear until, and then the preachers have to give it as God give it un, as the anointing because the anointing is what destroys the yoke. And if you don't give the word of God, there's so many people out there that is not getting it to that, to that magnitude. They're getting it where it's like, you are okay. It's okay to stop here. It's okay to just believe, you know, to this point. That's all you need to do, and you are fine. There is another level, praise God. And, and, and I can't express it the way I, I see the word examine is a whole new Sunday, it's a whole new Bible class lesson. That amen, amen, amen. Be broken down so we could teach people how to examine themselves. That's a whole nother Bible class. So Pastor P has some. <laughs> glory, glory to God. I'm going to uh, say this real fast, turn it back over to Pastor, Pastor Paul. Um, but Pastor Paul already said it too. He said you have to be first part first partakers. So before I before so before they was able to, you know, like I say, here he is when he first partaker. Now after he when he's when that person's first partaker is he received the Holy Ghost. Now you able to tell somebody, and so now so now you so now you be able, so now they now you able to tell because you experience firsthand. So yeah, now you were able to tell, tell somebody, right. but you can't tell nobody if you have an experience. Yeah, experience. So it goes yes. back to who's, 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 who's talking. Who, right, right. Who, who, <laughs> who are you listening to? Who have, where have you received it from? Mm -hmm. Because because it becomes firsthand. Like you say, where you're only able to testify, you're able to, for it to talk on what you experience. Mm -hmm. And so when you experience it, you're able to, so, you know, you're able to come out with it. And so it's able to, you're able to, um, uh, uh, explain it and explain it well because again it was it was received was first hand uh, first hand experience so you were able to uh, uh, be able to explain it and then now people are able to hear it and it's not sec it's not it's not from what you know or no it's from experience so that way you were able to tell them exactly firsthand and so and then like I say go it goes right back to where we, we have not so much as heard but then like I say you already it's uh, Pastor Paul, I'm getting ready to go into it, but we were talking about John's baptism, you know, mm -hmm. and they only went so far. But that's mm -hmm. what I love about this scripture because it allows to see, glory to God. That's what I love about this scripture because it allows to see that, you know what, we don't have to argue with nobody. You don't have to fuss with nobody. It just let us know that if you haven't, there's more, there's mm -hmm. more, there's mm -hmm. more. That's a continuation here, you know, so, so mm -hmm. glory to God. So I love the, I love the scripture. Back to you, Pastor Paul. <laughs> y'all didn't taught it. I don't know what y'all want me to say. I didn't want to say that. <laughs> y'all didn't taught it. Uh, but I, I'm going to piggyback off, off of everything that's been said. Evangelist Clark said that she was going with emotions. Mm -hmm. yes. She was, she was, Lord, I'm I'm ready. Lord, I want to be saved out, out of emotions. Mm -hmm. The scripture tells us that God knows your heart. Yes, yes, yes. yes, yes. yes he does. So as much as you say, Lord, I want to be saved. God, I want to be saved. 
and, and we cheering you on. Yes, say yes, love. Give it to him. Yes, yo. Oh, yes. Hi, ba ba ba. Yeah, ba 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 ba. And we going all that. God knows the heart. He knows the heart. He knows the heart. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's and when he now watch this, there is a yes, Lord, that moves people. But now, mm -hmm. then there's a yes, Lord, that moves heaven. All right now, yes. say that. Hallelujah. Say that. Hallelujah. See, you can say yes, Lord, and we saying yes with you because it moves us. We 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 know what we looking at. We see your facial expression. We see the tear. We see the snot. We see all these you 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 know you about to fall out. We we <laughs> we see all that. We 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 gone with you with that yes. Yeah. But when there's a yes coming out from the bottom of your belly and a sincere yes. It moved that. Listen, uh, I'm, that's I'm a, gonna stop there. That's a heavy move, right? That, that's a different type of yes. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. That's a different type of yes. Mm -hmm. And if the saints would sit back and listen, you will hear mm. when heaven been touched. Yes, that's it. Oh my God. Hallelujah. You will know hey. when heaven been touched. Say that. You, the, the atmosphere would change That's when it. heaven been touched. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ooh, yes. Touch him. That's the truth. I guess the truth. When oh, she my, my, turned my, around, my. she said, she told God, take it. Mm. She, she was there at that yes. Mm. She was in the surrendering <laughs> mode. Yes. She was in the Hallelujah. mode of God. I can't move without you. I don't want to yes. breathe without you. I don't want to. I don't want to take another step without you. I, I'm tired. I'm just. I'm, if you don't save me right now, I won't be saved. I need the Holy Ghost right now. I'm at the surrendering mode. Yes. Mm. Hallelujah. Take it all. Take it, take it. Oh, I want you more than I want that. Uh, uh, and cool. then Evangelist That's Owen cool. said, Hallelujah. Uh, Evangelist Owen said, Apply what you heard. Now, now, the scripture said, Let us not be hearers only, but doers of the yes. word. Hey, listen, you can't, you can't be a doer without applying. Mm. All right. All right. And in order to apply it, it got to change you. Because right. the Bible said that the word of God cannot return to him void, but it must accomplish what it was sent out. See, the word of God got a job. The Holy Ghost got a job. If you let the word of God come in, the Holy Ghost already know what to do with the word. Uh, oh, God have mercy. It's just, can you get out the way and let the Holy Ghost do what it got to do? Mm -hmm. Mm. Well, that's it. That's it. That's it. Man, it, man. Mm. Uh, she said, Lady Perkins said, another level. Mm. My God, that's, I, I feel like jumping when she said that because she, she in my notes right now. She in my notes. I didn't circle it twice because she <laughs> in, I'm, I'm all the way in Florida. She in my notes. <laughs> See, that's what the Holy Ghost will do. It'll take you to another level. It, it does. It, 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 mm, mm, mm. Amen. Amen. The assignment, now watch this, y'all. The assignment of the Holy Ghost is not to stay on milk. Woo! Stay there. All right. All right. The assignment of the Holy Ghost is to, to dissect the Word of God so that you can chew it because the word of God listen when you go to Bible class that means that you went from Sunday to Wednesday by the time you got the Bible class you either own a half a tank or a fourth of a tank mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. 
and the Holy Ghost need to be refilled. <laughs> so it needs the word of God to be refilled so that it can go from Wednesday or Thursday night to Sunday or to the next service. We used to have service on Monday night, Wednesday night, Friday night. We was at church on Saturday, and we definitely at church all day Sunday. My God, my God. These people talking about, I can't be at church from, from uh, I can only be there from 12 to 1. What kind of church you trying to have? What Holy Ghost is really using you in that one hour? What have you really surrendered in that one hour? Mm-hmm. <laughs> How are you going to put God on a time limit? <laughs> Mm. Let me stop. Let me stop. Let go, me ahead, go, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. The question was, have you received the Holy Ghost mm-hmm. since you believe? Their response was, and they said unto him, we have not heard so much where did there be a holy? Because they were still walking under John the Baptist. Yes, yes, yes. Now, watch this. John the Baptist's duty was to baptize them unto repentance because he said, he that come after me, will for, he will fill you with the Holy Ghost and fire. See, this, is, this thing was already laid out. They was being baptized unto repentance, which is Acts 2 and 38. Now you need to be baptized with the Holy Ghost, mm-hmm. which has many feelings. You you ain't yeah. just baptized one time. The Holy Ghost got many feelings. The reason that you ain't changed is because you ain't letting the Holy Ghost do the feeling that it needs to do to change. You can walk in the atmosphere and the atmosphere change because the Holy Ghost is feeling you. Mm-hmm. Let me let me let me leave that alone. Let me leave that alone. Mm-hmm. Leave that alone. Uh, Hallelujah. I should say, you ought to tell somebody. Now, 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 Pastor, we got a whole lot of people that want to tell somebody, but what can you tell me if you ain't living it? Mm-hmm. That's it. That's mm-hmm. it. That's right. That's right. Now, I like what you said better than I just said it, because <laughs> then it comes back to me that, watch this, you can't tell it unless you have experience. Yes. Mm. Uh huh. I asked the question: How many saints have been knocked off their beasts on their road to Damascus? Uh, my, my, my! That experience. See, we got too many saints that's still on their beasts. Uh-huh. You ain't been knocked off. <laughs> Okay. But when you encounter Jesus, he going to knock you off your beast. Mm-hmm. Right? That, what, that, what is your beast? Your beast is pride. Your beast is stuck up. Your beast is gossiping. Your beast is lying. Your beast is hormoning. Your beast is uh, 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 fornication, adultery. He'll knock you off that beast because he got to change. Yes, yes. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. He he got a duty. He got a he got a change. Oh, let me stop. Come on, evangelist. Owens, you say you have a a statement. Request. Yeah, just real, real, real brief. Cause you, you ain't gotta make it brief. We we it's we, it's gonna we be in brief. Quarantine. We all right. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's what you you got me back. You got me back. <laughs> but but I I I know people interchangeably say Holy Spirit and Holy Ghost. I do understand the meaning and definition. Mm -hmm. Um, But the Bible does have both statements, Holy Ghost and Holy Spirit and of spirit. But see, when you think of spirits, there are some spirits that was never in a body that died Mm -hmm. in Rosie. Mm Mm-hmm. When you think of a ghost, somebody was alive. Mm-hmm. 
that yes it that's it i love that i love that and they die uh -huh. that's the truth yes. different people say ghosts uh-huh i never recall satan dying and rising again that's a spirit evil spirit mm. lay that out lay that out ghosts it's comes that. from a living Woo. Oh, I just personally choose my term to be Holy Ghost. Yes. Because Jesus died. Jesus he died. He lived. He walked around doing miracles. He died and he rose again. And he sent his spirit, his spirit. which is called the Holy Ghost. <laughs> the essence of it. he sent him. Hey, that, that 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 part right there. Yeah, keep grabbing that part right there. That, that, she should have kept running with that part. He sent himself. Himself. Yeah. It's himself. He, sent, himself. He, he, didn't, he didn't send nobody else. He sent himself. Himself. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Not another form, but himself. Yes, yes. yes. Himself. Yes. Ah, so that's why he said holy ghost that will lead and guide you into all truth yes uh, uh, because i am true mm. oh god <laughs> so this is why it was important now oh, jesus have mercy see the, uh, i should remember you said we got all right, so go ahead <laughs> I should I should even gave her the opportunity. We should have had her towards the end to say something. She then <laughs> started up a whole new uh, Earth listen, that. Listen. we have received it. Work it. <laughs> now, now watch this. Joel 2 mm -hmm. and 28. Mm. Joel 2 and 28. And the Bible says these words. And it shall come to pass afterwards. That that afterwards still got me. That y'all, mm -hmm. y'all. Lord Jesus, that afterwards, that whoo. Let me behave. That I will pour out my spirit. Yes. Upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughter shall prophesy. Yes. Your old men shall dream dreams. Your young men shall see vision. See, this is why I, I gotta ask myself: Why are we worried about our children? Oh, yeah. All right. All right. Mm. All right. Mm. Oh, you see, we. That's a heavy load right there. Mm -hmm. If he said this promise is unto you and to your children and to your children's children and to them that are even are far off as many as the Lord our God shall call. And he said here that he's going to pour out his spirit upon all flesh and your sons and your daughters shall prop. He's telling you that they are already sealed. Mm -hmm. all right, all right. My Lord, my Lord. Amen, amen. Yes, yes, thank you. I don't care where they go. I don't care what they do. This promise is not to them. This promise is to you. I want you to live saved. I want you to be holy. I want you to be righteous. And I'm going to multiply that thing that's going to come off of you onto them. Ooh, glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah, uh, hallelujah. Uh, so I'm, that's why I told Pastor Perkins, I ain't worried about Tiffany. I ain't worried about Thomas. I ain't worried about Pappy. I ain't worried about I, Joshua. I ain't worried about, why? Because God made us a promise. Yes, right. yes. God, you have a shunda. Yes. And he's not a man that he should lie. Neither is he the son of man that he needs to repent. If he said it, that's it. Holy your shot. That's it. Yay, God. Holy the bush.
So all I gotta thank do you. is just keep living saved and thanking him. Like 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 my grandma said to us, she said, I told God and I told her, told her just the other night, you gonna be in a cloud of repentance mm -hmm. I ain't never seen in my life. Because for you to tell God, God, I'll serve you if you save all my children. Mm. And he saved all but one. Mm. And he's working on the one right now. Right. All right. All right. Hallelujah. He had to get the one and lock him up. Mm -hmm. To think about it. Because the one thought he was too bigger than God. Mm. Mm -hmm. So God had to put him in a place that he had to show him, you're not bigger than me. Mm. He had to humble him. He had to break him. Mm. But mm. look at the promise that he made and the promise that he kept. Yes. And the promise that he's doing even right now. You telling me that this God should not be served? Mm. 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 God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I, I, I thought about what Pastor was saying. Go tell somebody. Amen. When I first got the Holy Ghost, I told Troy and Jennifer, hey, let's go to the church and let's carry. Let y'all carry. <laughs> Listen, you can tell them, but use wisdom. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Use some wisdom. Amen. Amen. I didn't know how to tarry. What am I knowing how to tarry? And I just got saved for a month. How am I going to tarry with you? What do I know what to do with you? <laughs> Thanks be unto God. Thanks be unto God. Bishop Tyler and Lady Perkins was in the back of the church doing whatever they were doing in the office, back there dealing with the books. And they walked out of the back and they saw Jennifer and Troy uh, Terry. And, and, and Bishop Tyler just walked over there. He shook his head. He looked at me. He just shook his head. And he started tearing with Troy. And Lady Perkins went and started tearing with, with, uh, with Jennifer. And I just went to the altar. Lord, help me. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> help me. Help me. <laughs> I got these people up here tearing. And I don't know how to tear with them. <laughs> <laughs> God, I'm I'm I don't want to make you ashamed. I don't want to embarrass you. Help me. But I'm thankful that you had two seasoned people that's here that got the Holy Ghost that know what they're doing. Thank you that you 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 reigned around in the bush, you helping me out. Thank you. I, I appreciate you loving me that much. Just don't make me don't don't make me look Thank stupid you, again. Help me, help me, help me. <laughs> <laughs> but they came because they wanted <laughs> they wanted the Holy Ghost yes, yes. yes. That's it. yes. and I'm telling you both of them even though they didn't get it that day they got it now because the promise that God made mm. was secure mm -hmm. And I thought about, I thought about, I said, now, uh, I, 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 uh, Evangelist Owens, you help me if, if I'm not mistaken. But Sister Claudette was saved at the age of eight. Mm -hmm. That's, cor that's correct. Mm -hmm. was, is that correct? That's correct, yes. Okay. So you can't tell me that the Holy Ghost got an age limit. Amen. Right. Mm -hmm. He'll save you even when you that young. Mm -hmm. But we were so crazy. I was hanging with Curtis and Wesley and, and Jawan and, and Frank. We so crazy. We just don't listen. We just gonna tell the truth. We ain't studying no church. We ain't trying to, we come to see each other. We ain't trying to be around this saint. These old folks, these shouting people, we trying to just come and be around each other. Mm -hmm. um, and Wesley turned around and said, listen, my mama told me that we can't be, be doing this no more because I need to be saved. I turned around and talked to Wesley just last week. When did you get the Holy Ghost? 
He said, I ain't got it. I said, didn't you tell me a long time ago that your mama said <laughs> you can't do the stuff that you're doing because you need to get the Holy Ghost? He said, yeah. I said, so what's taking you so long? He said, well, I, I ain't done doing what I'm doing. I said, so you going to go to hell because you don't want to give up what you're doing? You can't tell me that the Holy Ghost ain't saved because it, it, it saved Jennifer. Mm -hmm. It saved Nisi. It, it, it saved Janelle. You the only one. You the last one. So when are you just going to come on in? Okay. Then when you come in, it'll bring Curtis. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and God will be able to reach Frank. Mm -hmm. Mm. Because the promise, the promise that God made still stands as sure. Since the boy is gone, but that promise still stands as sure. The promise is still there. That's it. The promise is still there. Yes, 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 yes. I love that. I love that. Promise don't die. Remember, Evangelist Sons has said that once before. I think it was the evangelist songs that just because, or either it was one of them, uh, the promise don't die just because the the one that that said it or the one that it's applied to. If he says that my family is going to be saved just because I passed on, you know, don't mean that the promise went with me. The promise is still That's right. The That's promise, right. and it said because right. far off. That's it. And so it's going to keep going because it still has to accomplish. It still has to accomplish. It's still because this word is not going to return to him void. He is not a man that he should lie. And so he didn't lie and is going to continue until it completes what it needs to complete. And I was looking right. at the evangelist songs. You have a statement. Um, uh, one thing I was looking at and when you, you had mentioned earlier that that part is to the saints also when when we go further into the meat of it. When we go further into the meat of it, saints have to live in the receiving mode. We have to live in the oh. as saints <laughs> and get to the place of okay, you know, because we understand the Holy Ghost. Okay, we got it. All right, okay. And so you get complacent in the fact that you say, I got it, I got it. But then, like you said, Pastor Paul, there are many refillings. God is still, is still leveling up. It's still leveling up. And we get complacent in the fact that, you know, we got it already. So therefore, now we can't, we're st we stop examining. We stop uh, 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 believing God through until he, until he take us out of here. You stop here because you arrived. You in your mind. See, see that, me being Cornelia, I, 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 he reminds me of these things because when you, you can't still after having the Holy Ghost get to a point where you still sin you you get to a point of saying, I'm okay. And we talk about this in Sunday school where we're grading ourselves. Even after the Holy Ghost, we start grading ourselves at this point. And God is saying, I'm not through with you. How you got you how you got the right to grade yourself? I didn't give you that grade. See, we getting these report cards, and you know how little kids did when they were oh. back in the day. You change that that F and you put <laughs> got an A, or you put a couple of curves on it and you got a B. You understand what I'm saying? So, so changing the grade that the teacher didn't give you, or either it's, it's twofold. You you know you know the truth and you just changing the grade, or you don't want to hear what the teacher got to say because you already know. See, so there's two ways of not believing to get the other feeling, to get the additional feeling. We're not coming back to get the feeling, the refill, the refill. That's where, that's where now we getting into the meat of this thing because we as saints got to still believe. We still got to go past our 
ourselves in thinking that we have arrived just because we understand the infilling of the Holy Ghost. That's not all. We don't stop there. We didn't stop, as we always say, at the pool. We keep going. We continue because we have to be refilled, refreshed, revived. It has to keep going. But when we get into a state of, I, I'm this and I'm that and I checked off and I this and I that. We as saints of God can get that way. So we cannot point our fingers at no one. We can't point our fingers across the fence. We can't point our fingers back behind the fence. You, you got to pay attention to where you are and what you're doing. And if you're blocking God for what he wants to do. And I just, I just love that when you, when you mentioned that, that's where God brought my mind to me. You said this is to the, this can be to the saints also if you, you really look into the refillings, you know, things like that. There's initial, and then there's a continuation. Praise God. The evangelist Owens. Hey Amen. I'm, I'm in total agreeing and enjoy, in agreeance, enjoying everything. Uh, uh, Jesus is the living water and living water moves. Mm -hmm. When Jesus was walking among us in, on the earth, he was doing, he didn't stay in one place. He mm -hmm. moved. Stagnated water stinks. And it gets mosquitoes. God has always been progressive. And, and, and if you look at the steward that did nothing, He's telling us, I don't like it when you don't do nothing. Anybody, anything that stops going is about to die. You got to keep moving. You got to keep progressing. If you don't even move your body, your bones get stiff. God is intending for production, always, until he comes. So the bottom line is, it ain't no, I'm good. I'm going to stop right here. I ain't got nothing else to do. I ain't got no more learning. That scripture, have ye received the Holy Ghost since ye believe? Have you received your next level since? Like Pastor Paul was saying, that have you gotten enlightened more? Mm -hmm. Have you learned more? Are you just stuck on Acts 238? See, if you're gonna be a disciple, oh. Oh. see, 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 many came and ate of the five loaves and two fish. But many didn't follow on. Disciples follow on. People that's just eating a the blessing, they ain't eat when it's done, it's over. But a disciple take on, follow on. We're disciples, not just people at a meal of two fish and five loaves of bread. It's many turned away. Mm -hmm. So when you look, I, I was thinking of what Pastor Paul was talking before when he was bringing up some conversations. Nowadays, many people don't want to be pricked. Tell me of a good thing. I got itching ears, so I only want to hear something that's going to tickle my fancy. Give me, tell me about a new car. Tell me about a blessing. But if you remind me that I'm in sin, and Jesus is coming. Signs of the judgment all around. You can put the Bible and the news side by side and see the hand of God. Oh, don't tell me that. See, see, people don't want to hear that. I, I listened to Pastor Paul brought out something that wasn't going to make somebody happy. Help me. I want to be saved. Yes. I want to make it. Yes. Sometimes somebody's feeling is going to be hurt. Mm -hmm. Why? We got to make it. I listened to the straightforward question. Melody hemmed me up with one question. Are you ready? I couldn't stand people asking me that question because I didn't know what ready looked like. <laughs> oh. But when I got tired of me, Lord, you, knew nobody you couldn't ask me no question that was going to make me turn back. But, but people prefer darkness. 
because their deeds are evil. Mm. Don't tell me something that's going to make me shake myself and come out of these sins that I've been petting. That's what people are dealing with today. And Jesus is coming. The clock is ticking. Every minute is one more minute to eternity. And people rocking in this saying it's okay. But I thank God for the straightforwardness sometimes because it's needed to. Yes, Jesus loves. Yes, God is good. But you can go too far till your time is up. We got to hear that. Why? Have you received? You got to receive this great gospel because it's hid from those that are lost. That's in that word. So I'm, I'm, I'm listening to that kind of question. If I was asked that, if I was reminded that, that Pastor Paul in that kind of way, that would have shook me. But I can respect somebody that say, I ain't ready. Mm -hmm. All right. But guess what? While you ain't ready to drop what you doing and you know ain't God ain't pleased, the clock is still ticking. That's the fear that was once placed in us. That's not present in many people. And I'm speaking in general. The gospel is supposed to cut and bind back. It's supposed to save us. And it can if we make room and receive it. Oh, that song again. Oh, make room. Yeah. Evangelist Clark had her hand up next. Praise the Lord. I, a couple of things. Uh, when Pastor Paul said, he asked the question, uh, how many saints have been knocked off their beast? I love that, mm -hmm. that statement. Yeah, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Now, the odd part of that, it ain't odd, but if you pay attention, he addressed that to the saints. Mm -hmm. When Paul was on that road and got knocked off, he was in the middle of a trap. He was coming, coming to a transformation. Mm -hmm. so the fact that he has to ask the saints with that question he has to address the saints with that question somebody needs to shake themselves mm. because now you didn't you didn't went back and put on what you should have been delivered already from so the question being asked, okay, you went and got the beast and got back home. That's the reality of that. Now, when you were talking about the, the promise being to the uh, to the kids and to far off, it was once said, and I believe I the, I think Mama said it, and uh, Mama said it, and it, it might have been Mom. It might not. No, actually, it wasn't. It was. It was a. It was a minister. It was actually Clifton Edwards Jr. And he was preaching a message, and he said, "Just because the prophet died, don't make the word came from." Because I'm trying to quote it, but that's what it was. Prophet Joel. We speak of him often when we say this by the prophecy by prophet prophesied by the prophet Joel. That's now, it. he spoke it when he said afar off. For mama, it was to us. Now, to you is to the children of that. But it didn't die because he said afar off. It already released itself out of the prophet's mouth. All right. All right. It already Just because can't return. Died, the word continues because it was given to him for it to continue. So mm -hmm. the word is still there. Even if Tiffany had kids, it's to her. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. But it started with Prophet Joel. Mm -hmm. So that word ain't never gonna die. Never gonna die. That 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 promise is until. <laughs> but I I it was it was something else. That, oh, the report card. When you mentioned about the report, when first lady was talking about the report card, <laughs> some people. Some saints, you find them grading themselves. You find them saying, where well, I do this. They may not be telling people. They may just be in a group of conversation with somebody, and they're speaking out loud about themselves, but they're not trying to do it boastfully. 
they're yeah. just they're in it in their mind to make to make whatever to make what to, to satisfy themselves to be comfortable in where they are because the fear of persecution mm. see when you don't have if ain't nobody got no reason see if you're not causing no friction nowhere you got to you know the word of god said be 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 um be careful when men mm. don't, don't they speak well of you always yeah something wrong with you if somebody just said oh oh, oh and you oh, well black in the pews you a minister and ain't ruffle no feathers in the pews something wrong Woo. sweet words can't come out of your mouth all the time you can say god love you but you got to give a word of deliverance meaning you got to be relative you got to speak into someone's life and meet them the word is supposed to meet them where they are now if they're not in god that means they're not in a good place so how can a good place you make you speak speak sweet of the person delivering the word to you so that's a check I, um, that's a minister to check they stuff and somebody always bringing you gifts and everything oh i just love that i just love it. and you know they ain't saved you know just, 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 what am i doing because you shouldn't be comfortable around me you should feel so warm and cozy and fuzzy around me when i got the holy ghost and i'm a minister and i'm preaching the gospel that's when you say lord am i saying it like you want me to say it because somebody got to be shaken in here. Because hell is real just as well as heaven is real. But you find people sitting and talking about, yeah, well, I know, yeah, I know, uh, I know that I, I, I'm just so this, I'm just so that. He said, no, I love God. They, they'll keep saying, I love God so much. I don't care what's wrong. I always give to the church. I always do it. You find people doing all It's like, okay. And... That's my response to that. Okay, and because I'm not here to, I'm not here to put you. I'm not here to put you in hell. I can't do that. But if that's all you can say, you're making yourself feel better because written the when and I'm gonna say a, a term from uh, uh, from somebody we know very well. Truth be told. When you go out there, if you know, it, your life should cause some friction. Just like it should change some atmospheres, it should shake some people up. The devil's supposed to be scared you coming. The devil's supposed to be upset that you even speaking to somebody and you speaking the word to somebody. They shouldn't sit up there and just be happy about it. They should be but they should be they should be sitting up here like they should be worried or either just nervous because the devil is already worried. That's why some people don't want the persecution. They want everything rosy. They want everything good. It don't happen like that because he said it in the word, you're gonna be persecuted for my name's sake. So if you in the name and if you're of the name and you're under the blood and you're carrying it and you're speaking the word of deliverance or reconciliation from the blood of Jesus Christ, then that's going to cause some friction. So saints can't be scared of persecution. Can't be scared to be dis disliked. Join the club with me. My occupation makes me not be in life. Then I went and got saved, and now I'm an evangelist. <laughs> I'm really hated. So, you know, I must not have cared. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? I must not have really cared at all. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? That half of the time, it made me coming from my occupation and then going into evangelism, it really didn't change much. <laughs> the hate just continued. You know what I'm saying? It just continued and built. That's it. <laughs> Now, now, now that 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 y'all did this, y'all did this, y'all did this. I, I I I I you said ruffle some feathers. Mm. 
we have lost sight of the saints being ruffled yeah. mm -hmm. to be right. Mm -hmm. Bishop Tyler had a service, and I don't know, this is how I took it when he did it. He made all the saints sit on one side of the church and all the unsaved sit on the other side. Bishop Tyler started to tell the saints, you ain't doing your job because it should not be too many. That too many unsaved sitting on that side of the church. What are you living? What are you doing? Where is your prayer life? He started to make them examine because some of them was grading themselves as if they had already obtained the position that God was pleased and God was Listen, you ain't even past the fourth row of saints. But you got the whole other side filled all the way back to the back row of unsaved. How are you satisfied? How are you pleased when there's only four rows of saints and a whole side of unsaved? He started ruffling. Start to make them... Hey, you you getting a little bit, your grade is not where you think it is. He he was talking to himself too. Mm -hmm. Cause when we got home, Bishop Hunter told my grandma, he, he turned around and told my grandma, he said, Listen, listen, Sister Bishop. Sister Bishop, listen to me, Sister Bishop. He said, God was talking today. We got Paul up there. Got Jonathan up there, got Manuel up there, Edward up there. They ain't saved. We ain't praying enough in this house. Cause they doing too much in this house that they they ain't fearing the God that's in this house. Mm. My God. He turned around to my grandma. He said, You need to get you need to get your prayer back to into place. You need uh, I was scared then. Because <laughs> when you get them two praying, mm. good Lord, have mercy. That's an example. Jonathan, stop letting all these different type of women coming in and out of grandma's house. I stopped talking on the phone. <laughs> Manuel just got up and moved out. <laughs> Edward moved out. <laughs> <laughs> Edward and Manuel just moved out. They, they, Edward said, I can't live in this type of atmosphere. <laughs> mm -hmm. But it was, it was, and then Evangelist Clark, she said, Now, uh, the devil got to recognize when you get up. He said, Paul, I know. Mm -hmm. Oh, see, uh huh? Jesus, That's right. I know. That's right. But who are you? Mm. All right. Recognize. See, see, if you grading yourself, he ain't scared of your grade. Mm -hmm. Because your grade don't have no authority. Your grade don't have no power. Your grade don't have no Lord have mercy. Yeah, yeah that's yeah, the yeah. examining. Yeah. That, that, that's, that's part the of the examining. That's, that's, yes, yes. Yes, just the she said while Paul was on his way. Now watch this. He got knocked off his beast while he was on his way to persecute the saints. <laughs> Some of us saints need to be knocked off of our beast because we persecuting each other in the church. <laughs> my lord, my lord. Uh, ouch. I, I'm gonna leave that alone. I'm gonna leave that. I, let me give y'all this last scripture because I didn't kept y'all two hours in Bible study. Y'all forgive me. Oh. Hebrews chapter five. This is going back to what Lady Perkins was talking about. 
Hebrews chapter 5 and verse 12. She made a comment. She was talking, this is what God gave me. I like this type of class because God gets to talk to you, give you all kinds of scripture, taking you all different ways. Amen. You can do things, but it still come back to have you receive <laughs> since, you, <laughs> Lord, amen, amen. since you believe. Hebrews 5 and 12 says this. He said, for when, for when, for the time, Ye ought to be teachers. Mm -hmm. Ye have need that someone teach you again, mm -hmm. which be the first principle of the oracles of God. And our babe become such as have need of milk and not of strong meat. That's it. That's it. My, 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 my. Mm. When you get to the place like you already think you arrived, mm. you have come to the place that he said you now need to be taught mm. all over. Mm -hmm. you, you, you didn't step out of being humble. Mm -hmm. You ain't even listening to the Holy Ghost no more. You all got right your right own now. program. Right. Yeah. You already know. You 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 think you know that's what the that's what it is. You think you know. Mm -hmm. But what you really don't know is that you are you are almost to the point of cutting yourself off. Look at that. Mm. 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 Oh, God, God don't dwell with unclean. My Lord, my Lord. And pride is a stinking spirit. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Pride is a stinky spirit. Stinky spirit. <laughs> Amen. Saints, saints, listen. Saints ought to be happy when God rebuked them. All right, Lord. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Glory. No, y'all don't know like that. Oh, that's, that's, a, that's I mean, a whole I different type of teacher. That's a whole type of me, different. That's me. a different type of teacher. See, because when. What when God rebuked you, he said, them that he loved, he chases. Yes. Uh -huh. And them that be without chasing, he called them a bastard. That's when he loved you, he correct you. When he loved you, he wants you to get right. He giving you the opportunity to repent. See, repentance ain't only for the say, repentance is for the saints too. That's it. Lord. That's why you ain't received since you believe because you ain't repented. Mm -hmm. There's some things that you still got to repent about. Ooh. Mm -hmm. That's all. I know uh, my wife told me, she said, don't write that. <laughs> <laughs> but Troy wrote something and, and I started to read what he was writing. And I turned around and I said, if you say you say. Mm-hmm. If you walking down that road that you say, the Bible said, touch not my anointed. He didn't say the people that's anointed. He said, my anointed. Yes, yes. And do my Make it play. No harm. See, when you put your mouth on the man or the woman of God, whether it's gossiping, lying, that's what you're doing. You lying anyway, because you just got a lying spirit because you you didn't follow the demon that just just well, let me leave that alone. <laughs> so my wife told me, she said, you can't be writing that on his post because then people gonna read it. They need to read it. <laughs> they need to write. I don't care what title you have. Lay your title down and go to the altar and repent. Y'all need to repent. I'm talking saints don't say talk about saints. Somebody. Help somebody. Saints don't that. hurt saints. Saints don't lie on saints. Saints don't gossip. That's it. All right. He said, lay your gift down and go to them and restore yourself. Get that thing together so both of y'all can put that demon that's trying to divide the kingdom, y'all can put them to a flight. 
Yes, yes. Speak yes, Holy yes, Ghost. Yes, yes. Speak Holy Ghost. And That's divide it. the kingdom. Glory to God. That's it. That's it. Mm -hmm. He didn't ask you to like them. He said love them. Mm -hmm. Sometimes love got a cut. Mm -hmm. uh, see. Speak, Lord. Speak, Lord. Hello. Hello. Speak that. The Bible said the word of God is sharper than any two-headed sword. It appears going in and it cuts coming out, but it got an assignment. Mm. Yeah. Oh, hallelujah. It got an assignment. The word has an assignment. Yes. Has we an got too many people playing church. You think you got time? You ain't, don't you know rapture is just tomorrow? Ooh, you can lay down tonight and be raptured out of here. You ain't got time to try to play church. You got to have your stuff together. Mm. I'm talking. That's Hallelujah. what I'm saying. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I don't lay down. I don't lay down to go to sleep. I'm repenting before I close my eyes. Yes, Lord, Lord, forgive me. Lord, yes, save right. me. I yes, need Lord. to be saved. God, I yes, want to be rapture ready. God, clear me. Clear. Yes. Oh, God, help me. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, yes, Lord. Yes, yes, yes. Hallelujah. Because if he called my name while I'm sleeping, I want to make me. I want to make it in with yes. peace. I want to yes. make sure I'm. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. He said it. He said not even. He said now watch this. He said now watch this. The 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 thing that we forgot. He said. He said. <laughs> he said and, and uh, wrinkle, blemish, or any such thing. All right. All right. Yes. See, you can have just one wrinkle and miss heaven. Oh. Oh, God. I, 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 don't, I ain't got time to have a wrinkle. I, I need him to iron everything out. Make it straight. Make it clean. Make it pure. Uh, it might not feel good, but I want to be holy. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Amen, amen, amen. May not feel good. Glory to God. Whatever it takes, I got to make it. Yes. 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 My wife turned around and told me, she said, oh, I think God made us come together because he knew I was going a whole different way. I said, no, he made us to come together because that was his will. All right. mm -hmm. yes. Yes. He knew you wasn't apostolic. Now you apostolic. You drawing your mama in. Mm. All right, all right. You can't tell me what God won't do. <laughs> I said, but you can't you can't be scared to tell her the truth. She might not like it right now, but it's helping her. Give her the truth. She going to church, thank God she going to church. She learned, she going to Bible study, thank God she going to don't don't forget to tell her she need to be saved. She need to be filled with the Holy Ghost. She need to be baptized in Jesus' name. Not because it's the apostolic doctrine, but it's because it's the word of God. Mm -hmm. it's the word. Yeah. That's it. That's it. That's it. Uh -huh. Not That's pushing it. doctrine, we pushing word. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. That's all we doing. It's Let me give y'all this the last scripture, I promise. <laughs> this we this one right here. This, this one right here. This one right here. It, 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 when God gave me this one in studying, I learned that we beating people up unnecessarily. Mm -hmm. Y'all hear what I'm saying? We beating people up unnecessarily. Look what he says, St. John 10 and 16. He said these words in St. John 10 and 16. He said, and other sheep I have, mm -hmm. which are not of this fold, them also I must bring, mm -hmm. and they shall hear my voice, and they shall be one fold, mm -hmm. and 
one shepherd. Ooh, we are beating people up right. because they Baptist, they Catholic, they're this, they're that. He said, but I have a sheep of a different food. All right now. All right. So I'm saying we're not talking. And all he asked us to do is just to give them the word. Yes. 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 Amen. He ain't asking you to try to dress them up. He ain't asking you to try to make them. He said, just give them the word. Because one planet, one watering, but it's me that's going to give them the Holy Ghost. It's me that's yeah, going to transform that's them. The it's me that's going to do the rest. All I want you to do is do your assignment. Yeah. And you don't know your assignment unless you let the Holy Ghost guide you in your assignment. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So if the Holy Ghost ain't guiding you, then you just toss to and fro. You doing what you want to do. God ain't getting no praise out of that. That's it. That's it. Man. He said, but I have a sheep of a different place yes. that I will bring in. He don't need your assistance. Mm -hmm. He needs I you to live it. Mm -hmm. He didn't ask you to tell him that that, that dress is too short. He just asked you to love him. Mm -hmm. yes, yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes. He said, because with love and kindness have I drawn them. All right. Yeah. Yes, yes. I tell the I tell the sisters in our ministry, don't tell nobody in this church that their dress is too short if you ain't gonna go buy them a dress that's long enough for them to come to church. <laughs> you ain't gonna spend your money to go buy them something that come that won't offend you, then keep your mouth closed. And let God keep doing what he does because God is going to change. They'll see that it's not, they, they'll look at it and say it's too short and they want to do better. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. But if yeah. you always, oh, good, look, that, that's supposed to be under the knee. Da, 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 da. You driving them away. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. They ain't going to want them come. Mm-hmm. Tell my wife, I said, you for to be the role model to the women. They looking at you. They seeing how you dress. Some of them, was, one of the young ladies told my wife, I'm not trying to look old fogey. My wife said, I don't look old fogey. <laughs> she said, I know you don't, but I'm not trying to be dressing like the mothers of the church. She said, I don't dress like the mother of the church. She said, but I come presentable. Mm -hmm. And the young lady turned around. She said, can you take me where you go get where you get the outfits that you get so I can come presentable? See, that's loving kindness. Mm -hmm. I ain't trying to look like these old deacons coming in with them hats on their head. And I <laughs> <laughs> I ain't arrived to that stage yet. I still, <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to be like Pastor Percy. I'm coming casual. And, and yeah, <laughs> they turn around and say, Pastor, you want to be in a suit teaching Bible class. No, I don't. <laughs> I come. <laughs> hey, show me in the Bible where you tell me I got to wear a suit coming to teach Bible class. Yeah. You tell me that. <laughs> 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 they said, well, Pastor, you required us to have, I said, that's on Sunday, because that's what I want us to present ourselves as if we are kingdom building. That's it. Yes, yes. Just teaching them how. And so if I'm wearing a certain Amen. thing, I want you to come and present yourself. I said, it's just like you going to go see Mr. Orange, you will put on a suit. You ain't gonna go see Mr. Orange in no orange in no shorts and a t-shirt. Mm -hmm. right. so why would you come? Why would you come to God presenting yourself like that to God? Amen. He's the king. It's the king. You gotta come and Amen. present yourself royalty. Right. You gotta present yourself righteous when you come Amen. into the king. The, the king ain't gonna just accept anything. Mm -hmm. That's right. Come up. 
That's part of the said, so come on, come on, come on. And they tell me, Pastor, I don't have the money. I don't worry about it. Just, just keep coming. Just keep coming. God will make the way to make to change the outfit. Just keep coming. Let the word do the changing on the inside. Right, God will man. change the outside later. But just keep coming to get the word. Yeah. Let the word ministry. Let the word ministry. Let the word minister. Yes. That's it. Turn around and say, Pastor, I don't know how we got through it this time. I had, a, I had a couple to tell me, a married couple to tell me, Pastor, we was on our way to divorce. I was on my way to divorce him. But something you said in your word, I said, no, it wasn't my word. It was God's word. Mm -hmm. Amen. She said, I just ripped up the divorce paper. I said, God, to God be the glory. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Now, I said, if you had grounds to do it, then I ain't, I ain't against you. I can't tell you to stay with somebody. She said, well, the other pastor did. I said, I ain't them. All my job is to give you the word. The word. That husband turned around, came to the church. He turned around. He said, Pastor, I don't want to go back home without the Holy. Mm. All right. Now that's what I'm talking. Mm. Yeah. I said, you can have it today. He said, Pastor, if God stopped my wife from divorcing me, I don't want to go home without the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. I Pastor. I said, do you believe that he'll fill you? He said, yeah. We took him to the water. It took us an hour and 15 minutes just to baptize him. <laughs> and the man would be still enough for us to baptize him. <laughs> he was shouting all around the pool. My Lord, my Lord, my Lord. I love it. I love it. And I told my wife, I said, listen. I said, this is a sign to me that God is with me everywhere I go. Hallelujah. Yeah. She said, she said why you, you say that? Yeah. I said, when we was in California, I was pastor in the church. And we came to Revelation. And all mm -hmm. the older people that was in that ministry Amen. came and got baptized in the name of the Lord. Jesus. Hallelujah. They were following Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. But they took on the name. That's what I'm talking. So you can't tell me that this thing don't follow me. This oh yeah, is Shanda. This is the sign. Yeah. Well, follow them. Shabbat. Shabbat. Believe. Yes. Yes. These are the yes. signs. You ain't got to yes. go in there and try to beat up on people. Just yes. preach the word. Just yes. give them the word. God will yes. give them yes. the yes. instruction. God will give them that they need to be filled with yes. the Holy Ghost. God will give them that they need to be baptized in his name. I said, and they was older saints. Yes, I remember they came. I remember that. I remember. I said, and Pastor Perkins was in the baptism pool with me. Mm -hmm. I, said, I remember that. There was. I remember. There was a young lady. I'll never forget it. There was a young lady. When we got out of the pool, she was sitting there crying. Mm -hmm. And I turned around and I said, why are you crying? She said, because I want to be baptized like they do. I said, all you have to do is tell the sisters to get you ready. We would have stayed in the water. We didn't have a problem waiting for you. We would have stayed in the water. <laughs> Pastor, we got another soul that want to go down. All right, get them ready. We ain't got nowhere to go. We all right. We, we uh, all right. It's all about the souls. That's what I'm saying. Oh. About the souls. About the soul. It's all, about, it's all about the soul. I said, all you have to do is tell one of the sisters that you wanted to get baptized. I promise you, they'd have got you ready. She uh -huh. said, I got a boot on. I got this boot on, Pastor. I said, baby, they would have wrapped that boot up with some plastic. They'd have made sure that you, <laughs> they, they would have got you in that water. <laughs> I promise you that. That's right. That's right. That, yes. Why? Because they know the severity of the soul. Amen. Amen. And they know how the enemy works. When you mm -hmm. walk away now, now he gonna play with your mind. Mm -hmm. Now he gonna tell you you got time. That's now right. he gonna tell you that you don't have to do it. Now he gonna tell you all these different things. But the day that you hear my voice. Oh yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Harden not your heart. Hallelujah. I said today was your day. Mm -hmm. Today yeah. was your day of salvation. Hallelujah. The water was, the water is still trembling. You want to go down? And she couldn't answer. She just kept crying. I said, well, 
we'll let it go. We ain't gonna force you. But when you ready, we ready. Mm-hmm. And we'll come back just for one soul. It don't matter to me. They'll, mm-hmm. they'll be oh, glad uh-huh. to take one soul down. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> she turned around. She told me, she said, Pastor, I ain't never met nobody like you. I said, you would never, you would never meet nobody like me. I'm, I'm, I'm from Revelation. <laughs> <laughs> I see Evangelist always have something she want to say. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I'm loving every word I'm hearing tonight. You know, I'm, I'm thinking about the fact that we got to go get them. My godmother used to say, I ain't seen not one. A uh, hedge or one highway in the building. <laughs> we got an assignment. The Holy Ghost have an assignment in us and want to work its assignment in us. And we got an assignment to allow it. That's 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 that takes up the time right there. We gotta allow the Holy Ghost to do his assignment. We, he said, uh, uh, he talked about here, here, you know, we got it here. It, they said, have you received since you believe, since, since you heard, mm-hmm. you, I mean, since you believe, they said, we haven't even heard. Well, guess what? Today, we <laughs> with the Holy Ghost have heard. What did we hear? Well, I'm saved. I, I know you saved already. No, we heard something else. We heard go higher. We heard go high. We heard get a stronger grip. Yes. Yes. We heard get busy. Yes. We heard get up and do something. We heard something tonight. We are hearing. So it ain't just to the center. But we haven't even heard. Because when you get the want to on the inside. See, when you hear and allow the word to penetrate, it'll give you a want to. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. It'll give you. I may not understand, but I want to do better. Yes, yes, yes. It, it'll go beyond. A, I want to do better. To guide me, lead me, guide me along the way. Show me how to put it on. Take my yoke upon you and learn to me. All right. Took you. I took the yoke upon me, Lord. I, I took your yoke upon me, but I gotta learn. Help me to walk in it. In what I've heard. If I do that, I'll be a better saint of God. I'll be a better representative and ambassador for Christ. Yes, yes, yes. I will represent you in this earth better if I allow you. Why? I heard something. And the day you hear his voice, the night you hear his voice, the hour, hard, not your heart. And it opened the door for a refilling. Yes, yes. What we heard Glory is making room, making room for a refilling. Praise God. Praise God. Turning it to the hands of the pastor. Oh, my oh, God. oh he, Danny was clocked out of him. Oh, yes. Real, real quick. This, as, with all of that being said, it took us back to the beginning of scripture. And it also took you back to when it said, when when uh when Pastor read about let the uh, about the word, let it not leave thy mouth. Mm-hmm. Yes, 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 yes. And I thought about the scripture, let the words of my mouth. All right, and a meditation. All right. And a meditation of my heart. Mm-hmm. Be acceptable. Acceptable. In that side. In that side. That, that's that's talking about a life. Mm-hmm. Lord, that's a life, Lord, yes. right there. That's talking about the word that 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 word that don't let it leave your mouth, but let the words of my mouth that's in there be the meditation of my heart. I ain't gotta speak it, but it need to be the meditation of my heart, though. Mm-hmm. But let it be acceptable in our sight. Yes. That I, I thought about that way in the beginning, but then when I as the lesson went on and came around, we are talking about a life. We're talking about since we now we're hearing higher. So that means what are we meditating on? Is it the word? Let the word penetrate. Let the word stay in there. And if the word stay in there, let the words of my mouth. 
be the meditation of my heart. I can't do nothing but live with it then. With all that working together, I can't do nothing but live what's in my meditation, what's in there. I can't do nothing but live it. And the ultimate reward is oh, really? <laughs> the ones who did. Yes. Millions didn't make it, but I, I was one of the ones. It goes all the way down to I got to make it. Yeah. yeah. That's, it. <laughs> that's it. That's it. God, praise I got to make it. Ends of the pastor. Praise God. Hey. I got to make it. I got to make it. Got to make it. Glory mm. to God. Glory to God. Mm. It's a must. Glory yeah. to God. Glory to God. We yeah. want to, I got we it. Want to thank Pastor Paul. Glory to God. That was awesome. Beautiful lesson. Beautiful. And let me guess. I'm just going to give it here. Amen. Everything. Amen. It's awesome. And I love the way. <laughs> we're talking about the Holy Ghost leading God. And I love the way the Holy Ghost, just like I said, for us, just. Uh, directed and guided and for us brought out the whole entire lesson and allow we able to each each and every one of we all able to grab something it helped us tonight glory to god and you know it, but why because we heard it glory to, god. Mm -hmm. glory to god now after we heard we got to put it and say well i'd apply glory to mm -hmm. god glory to god but i i love it i love everything that was said and done pastor paul one more time we appreciate you thank god for the love work. you doc Glory to God. Thank you God for breaking it down. Glory to God. Got meat tonight. Yeah. We're not, it's another scripture. We're not going to be able to look at the same. <laughs> <laughs> oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. He covers the whole, everywhere around it. Glory to God. So we thank God for you. Thank God for the work. I thank God for each and all the saints of God on the Zoom and the conference line. We thank God for what this is. This is this is a, this is helping us. This is what we need to be able. To, we we want to be better. We want to do better. Glory to God. We want God to be pleased with our life. Mm -hmm. Glory mm -hmm. to God. Glory mm -hmm. to God. So we thank God for what we heard. Hallelujah. There's nothing else. Matter of fact, uh, uh, Evangelist Diane, you kind of said the benediction already. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, yes, yes. So we don't. Yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna just echo that, echo those words, and then we're gonna we're gonna say you know good night to all the saints. But let the words of my mouth, meditation of my heart, be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord. Yes, Lord Jesus. My strength, Hallelujah. Mm. Hallelujah, my son. Yeah. In the name yeah. of. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Lady P, whatever announcements we have. Uh, well, our announcements is praise God. Oh my God. Our class was awesome. Yes. Awesome. Yes. awesome. Yes. Praise God. And, and they have been awesome every week. Thank you, Jesus. You know, praise Thank God. You. And you wonder who got these scriptures. <laughs> <laughs> He's the pastor did. Uh, okay. You know, Daniel coming up, you know. <laughs> Woo -wee. We will get back to the pastors can handle the Daniel. Praise God. Praise God. <laughs> Amen. He's the one did that. Thank you. Thank you for that one. Thank you for him. <laughs> He's the one came up with all these scriptures. All I did was put them uh -huh. up. Yeah. That's it. Pastor did that. <laughs> so, but, but, but that, but that's what we want. We want God to just lead. Our, our Bible classes are so unique. I love our Bible classes because we could just break it down and chew on me. Just get, you know, and let everybody take part in it because each one, God gives each one of us something. And that's the essence of the lesson. Each one, teach one. Let God give us something and then we all uh, exegete it. Is that the correct word? You know, y'all are Bible scholars. Y'all the scholars. And so okay. break down the word of God and I enjoyed it. But I I, I thank the Lord for our, our uh, don't forget our offerings. Um, and God is blessing us oh. and we say thank you. This is good ground. This is good ground. So when you plant a seed, look for your harvest. Look for your harvest because Whoa. this is good ground. Praise God. We'll be back here on Sunday morning with Sunday school. The Lord say the same. And just one little word. Uh, uh, and I know Pastor Paul will get this. I find space for what I treasure. And I make time for <laughs> I choose my priorities. 
and Jesus, you're my number one. Oh. <laughs> Praise God. Praise that's God. the make room. Jonathan McReynolds. I'll, I'll shoot that out. Oh God, that's my God. What, this, what was going on tonight is make room. Hallelujah for that refilling of the Holy Ghost. So turn it back into the hands of the pastor. <laughs> Praise the Lord, saints. Again, we thank God for everything that was said and done tonight. May the Lord continue to bless you. Have a beautiful night. What's left of it? And Pastor Paul, again, one more time. Thank you. Wait. Or you, you got a comment? Harvest testimony. What's what's that? Yes, praise the Lord. You you talked about good ground. Sometimes there's the testimony that we wasn't expecting, and I didn't want to interrupt, but you mentioned something, and and I want I had a quick testimony regarding this good ground. Yes, Amen. I was praying to the Lord concerning, and I give God the glory. Praying to the Lord concerning a situation that I had while I was trying to calculate my finance. You know. And um, you know how we pray those prayers? You know, Lord, you know. You know the you know prayers? Anybody ever pray the you know prayers? Yep. Lord, you know. Lord, you know. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, while I was telling the Lord, you know, you know. Still many praying. Times have, huh? I'm still I, I, praying. I thought, <laughs> well, you know, it's easy. It's easy to have faith for somebody else. But when it's your turn. And when you start telling the Lord, Lord, you know what I try to do. You know, you know what I try my best to do. And what, you know, all the you know. Yeah. Then the Lord told me, do you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I get it like that. Y'all know. He uh -huh. talks back to me. Do you know what's in your wallet? Mm -hmm. And I went to my wallet. And I had some checks folded up. Because I get them little five dollars twenty seven cent checks. <laughs> Only you. I get those little uh, ninety seven cents check. Were you like, why did they even put this on paper? <laughs> <laughs> but I fold up some, so you know, just put it to the side. Just fold it on up. And the Lord said, look in your wallet, your I love Lucy wallet. You just stuffed it on and just put them to the side and stuffed them on in there. I didn't read one of the checks. <laughs> the check covered my situation that I had not calculated. Mm -hmm. <laughs> While I was telling God, you know. Yes. God right. said, do you know? <laughs> and I, all I can say is, no, I didn't know. <laughs> yes. I love God. Yes, yes, yes. And I like him. Mm. Did you hear what I said? Yes, mm -hmm. I love him. Hey, and, I like him. Oh. and I like him. Yes, mm. Lord God. We have a relationship. Hallelujah. Yes. You can't beat that. Mm. Mm -hmm. We don't just let you pray to him. He responds. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. 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 He knows the way I take. Ooh. He knows my name. Mm. Hey, hey, hey. Mm. Woo. And I bless him. Mm -hmm. I bless him, the God of every nation. Yeah. I bless his name. Hallelujah. I bless his name. Yes, yes, yes. Hey, his name is above every name. The Lord our God is one God. Yeah. I give him the glory. Mm -hmm. He's my provider, my Jehovah Jireh. Mm -hmm. I love him and I like him. Mm -hmm. Pray for me. Ooh. Sound like somebody got milk with that meat. All right. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I'm gonna let you go. God, y'all wow. messed up too now. Pastor Paul, I, I would just <laughs> because. Go ahead, Paul. No, no, because listen, listen, listen. She didn't. She. I wasn't gonna say this. I was gonna wait till Sunday, but since she, since she, she, she poured that out, uh, we want to give another praise report. Uh, that we have uh, found land. All right. All right. 
to start building Hallelujah. the church. And to God be the glory. Yeah. As a matter of fact, uh, somebody that we don't even know that is been listening on Facebook uh, wrote a check oh, and gave, uh, wrote a check to the church to give to the realtor mm -hmm. um, to, go. to go ahead and uh, start the paperwork to purchase the land. What? And they turned around and said, uh, they turned around and told us to uh, whatever the balance is if you keep preaching like you preaching, mm. we'll pay the balance. Oh my glory to God. That's what See, that's what I, that, that's it right there. Glory. <laughs> <Hallelujah. laughs> uh, uh, my wife, my mm. wife said, who who is and, it, and we ain't never met these people. Um, mm. they come on after we sign off, they come on and they listen afterwards. And that's what I'm talking. Did, uh, they they reached out to us and told us uh, that God told them to sow. And, and I, I'm I'm like Zena. I thought it was you know the little thing, the, the little little sow. But these people are so they've been sold over a thousand, two thousand dollars to put down on the land. To get us ready my to go Lord, be. My Lord. And, Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. I, 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 I cannot get off of here tonight after hearing Zena testify and, and not give God uh, the glory and the praise Hallelujah. for what Thank he's you, doing. And my wife told me, she said, So what are we going to do? Are we keeping our name? I said, No. Remember, God told us to change our name. Mm. Revelation number two. I remember that. That's what we change it. Hallelujah. In the process of changing our name to Revelation number two. Mm. Uh, and so to God, glory to be the glory. God. Yeah. Glory. I, I, I want y'all to know, amen, this is not our doing. This is the Lord doing. Mm. And it is marvelous. Marvelous. In our eyes. Hallelujah. I, I would have never thought that that this will happen especially in this time right uh, but god can touch somebody even in the pandemic yes that's it yes. So, in the pandemic jeremiah ball man the, the pandemic ain't gonna stop god from blessing it Ooh, sure he's don't gonna bless mm -hmm. amen so my wife turned around she said do you think i said don't worry don't we ain't gonna think we ain't gonna <laughs> 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 Take our mind off of this. We ain't thinking. We ain't trying to figure nothing out. We're gonna go every direction that God tells us to go. Yes. And, Leave this, me. and this this realtor that we have, uh, she Die. sold her Die. her and her husband sold two thousand dollars into the ministry. Mm. And she said, she said, now when when y'all open the door, there's more coming. She said, y'all make sure y'all invite us to y'all first service. Oh and her husband, I talked to her husband from yesterday. And he told me, he said, I ain't never heard nobody teach like you teach. He said, why do you look so mean when you teach? I, said, I, I, I don't mean to look mean. I apologize. I don't, he said, you look so serious when you be on there teaching. I said, it is serious. The word of God is serious. Amen. He said, but my God, you be looking like, you be looking through the screen and right in our spirit and just tearing us up. Can you just relax a little? I said, well, <laughs> Pray for me then. <laughs> but we never know. We Amen. never know. Amen. We never know who we this word know. go out to. Right. Amen. I, I, I know it, we, like Lady Perkins, she sent it to me. And then I send it to other people. Amen. I don't just keep it to me. I send it to other people. 
Amen. Amen. The word of God needs to be touched to everybody. Yes. yes. You never know who never. God is going to use to bless the ministry. But All right, right now. Good. Signs and wonders. Glory to God. Glory to God. This, you know what? I know we was, I know we had talked about you know for a benediction, but this has been, I'm enjoying it because this has been like testimony. <laughs> the power and what God is doing. I, it, the Lord has blessed Revelation. You know, he keeps, he keeps on blessing us. It was, a, it was a friend of mine I haven't talked to since 1982. And wow. He, he, called my, he called one of my other buddies, then called my, myself. I mean, you know, told, told my buddy, he told, told my buddy that he said, he said, tell Glenn to call me. But I called him. I haven't talked to him since 1982, and we were just talking and how God has blessed him and what God is doing in his life. And then I was, you know, I was telling him about the, you know, for us how we, 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 was at, we was at the food program, as a matter of fact, that particular day. And he said, "I want to do something for you." He said, "I want to send three checks." Glory to God. Mm. Coming from out of from a different place, different state, different, you know, different, you know, you know. He said, "I want to send you send the send the church three checks. You want to donate?" I said, "What? <laughs> you absolutely right, Pastor Paul. You don't know where your blessing is coming from." That's right. Amen. Amen. Since 1982, and God touched his heart. Mm -hmm. And turn around. I didn't. I mean, I didn't have to. Say, he just said, you know, this, he said he wanted to do it. Mm -hmm. Then he called to confirm it tonight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Right before Bible class, mm -hmm. he confirmed. Signs and wonders. He wanted to make sure. Where do I? <laughs> <laughs> God is doing it. Yes, he is. Hallelujah. Mm. He's helping us all. Glory mm. to God. But it's God. He's doing it. Glory He's doing you. it. He's doing Hallelujah. It's well, you, God. To God be the glory. I love all the tests, everything that was saying, Pastor Paul. Everyone, everyone. Uh, Pancho's on. Good ground. Glory to God. It's yeah, the good ground. Glory mm. to God. But God is doing it. He's helping us all. And we, know, we don't know where it's coming from. But thank God. Hallelujah. He don't forget. He sees your labor. Ha! Huh? Glory to God. Of love. Hallelujah. See it. Jesus. You and it went on, glory to God. But he see it. Mm -hmm. And you think that, oh, <laughs> glory to God. But God don't forget. He remembers and he will reward. Glory mm -hmm. to God. But I, I just, because look, I'm, I'm listening to the testimony. I'm just looking at what God is doing. And this was right before Bible class. We got the confirmation as well. I mean, and, and like Pastor Paul, I couldn't get off the line myself until when I started hearing. <laughs> I got to give God the glory too. We all do, you know. Mm -hmm. well, Pastor, Pastor Paul said something early on in the lesson when he said, there's a yes that moves people. Yes, yes. But there's a yes that moves heaven. Yes. Mm. Glory. Amen. Amen. So that's the next level. When it moves heaven and you continue with the yes of moving heaven, it's nothing else but to do but to receive what heaven is going to do. Mm -hmm. yes, sir. Yes, sir. So I, I'm just ready to start. Right. Ready, 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 ready for next level. I'm ready, to, I'm ready to go with it. Let's go with it. Our goal is to move heaven. That's it. Move heaven. Hallelujah. Let's aim for heaven. Let's, let's, let's aim for heaven. It's going to yeah. come back right yeah. everybody else and everything if your goal is heaven. <laughs> oh, heaven. oh my goodness! Oh. Heaven is mine. Oh, singing oh heaven, heaven shot. is mine. Oh, Don't you wanna heaven. go to heaven? Yes, heaven is mine. Don't you wanna go to heaven? <laughs> heaven is mine. Great. Oh, yeah. Great. Yeah. Woo, heaven. Oh. Hallelujah. That's the name of Jesus. Oh man, this is just oh, God. this has been mind blowing. Yes, yes. yes. God. Just the just from the beginning all the way to now is mind blowing. And it encourages God is just gonna answer as long as we give that yes. 
that moves heaven. Stay on the wall. Stay, that's it. That's Stay it. Oh, my God. Oh. We is all the. We is all the. Yes. We is all the. Yeah. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. yes, we yes. exalt you. Oh, God. Yes. Oh. If y'all don't feel God right now, yeah, I'm a shot. I know I do. Oh, yeah, I'm a shot. Lord. Right. Right. right now. He is in the midst. Praise him. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. Oh, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless your name, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise him, Yasha. Praise him, praise him, praise him, praise him. We we are scheduled to come oh, yeah. to California, but I'm not coming until y'all y'all get back in the building. I got I got the date. I got the flight. Um, trying to get yes. open. Y'all trying. I got the. I'm, 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 listen, I I didn't. Apostle person is supposed to be doing something this month. I'm gonna send him a love token. Yes. But I can't I can't make it to it. Um his appreciation, I think it is. Mm -hmm. uh, and and I talked to him and, and I told God I won't I don't wanna be like Apostle Person because I don't know what he had to go through to get to where he is. Right. Uh, but I told God I won't I want him to bless me like he blessed him mm -hmm. for all these years to have, not have his door closed for all these years. And you find in ministries, these bootleg preachers all about money. They get the money, then they close the door. Mm -hmm. They ain't worried about no soul. I said, but God, you can bless that man with a plate in his head. Mm -hmm. Preach three and a half hours, <laughs> preach yourself wet and preach yourself dry and never have a headache. Mm -hmm. God, if you can give him that type of word, I know you can do something with me. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's it. That's, That's it. it, Pastor. Yes, Glory that is so. Oh, true. Glory to God. <laughs> so I, I told Pastor Person, I'm going to send him a love token to. We wanted to come and surprise him and be uh, a surprise guest for him in this appreciation. Uh, but we wasn't able uh, to do it. But I told my wife, I said, make the airline ticket, but leave it open date. Mm -hmm. So when all this stuff is done, we ain't got to do nothing but just fill in the date mm -hmm. and go. I said, and then I, I still be able to go see him. Mm -hmm. I might not be able to shout like he shout, but I, I'm I'm gonna go see him. <laughs> that man got a shout. I told Troy, I ain't never seen nobody shout like that man. Mm -hmm. And kick his legs up across his legs. And... Sure. Yeah, that's fire starter right there. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That that's a is... preacher machine. Awesome man of God. Yeah. That that is a preaching one machine. Yes, yes. Oh, glory to God. Oh my God. Well, we thank God, Pastor, Pastor Paul. Again, one more time. Thank God for. I thank God for that. Lord, having His way. Glory to God. My God. My God. Well, again, like I said, <laughs> we're going to be we're, 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 we're try again. <laughs> 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 Have a blessed night. <laughs> <laughs> we can try we it have. again. <laughs> That's what y'all get to try and get benediction before God through. <laughs> you lose your place then. You don't know where you at now. You don't know where you at. <laughs> All you do is say, ah. Let it be a lesson. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm Love you, sir. <laughs> <laughs>